This video is about making Russian pierogi. It is part of our series on making pierogi. Links to other parts of this series are below the video. The first step is to roll out the dough. The dough should be rolled very thin. When you roll it, roll it to the point where you can see your fingers and hands through the dough. After rolling two pieces, put them aside and put your pierogi form on the bench. Cover that pierogi form with flour. The flour prevents the dough from sticking to the form. Once the form is covered with flour, cover it with dough and then add the filling. The video about making Russian pierogi filling is below along with a lot more information about making pierogi. Fill all the pockets. You can add it either as I do here by having pre-rolled pieces or you can use a teaspoon to measure and fill each pocket. Cover the filling with another layer though and gently press it down to form the pocket. Once you have the pockets formed, use your rolling pin to cut and seal the pierogi. This is fast and easy to do. With that done, take off the excess dough and put it aside for reuse. To minimize excess, you can weigh the dough before you roll it <clears throat> and weigh the excess. The difference is the amount you should start with next time. Turn the form over and pop out your pierogi. Look how nice and easy it is to do and how nice and plump they are. These pierogi are now ready to be boiled and served, boiled, baked, or fried. They are so fast and easy to make that even the kids can do it. Go ahead and make some more for the freezer. Below the video is a lot more about serving, making different fillings, garnishes, and much more. Share this video with your friends by sharing it on Facebook. The share link is below. Add your comments and ask questions using the comments box. And finally, to get more information about all our videos, subscribe. While you're at it, click on the bell so YouTube notifies you when we post a new video. Thank you for watching and here's to your success in making pierogi.